Hi guys, welcome back. We are working our way through some regrouping and regrouping is really tough for us because it's brand new, but you guys are going to be really good at it by the time we're finished, I promise. Um, let's see, we're going to start off with a question about bats. Do you know bats can eat lots of insects, like thousands of insects um, each night? Yeah, so they're really helpful to us. So well, let's pretend that a bat is eating some mosquitoes, some pesky mosquitoes, okay? Let's say the bat ate 49, 49 mosquitoes in the morning, and then later on he ate 33 more. So that's like we're just a little snack for our bat, okay? So we want to add 49 plus 33. I'm going to model it in my mind first so I can kind of get an estimate of like where it should be close to, the answer should be close to. Um, and remember, this is kind of what we do in our mind mentally when we're at the store and we don't have paper and pencil. So I'm going to do that for you and model it. Okay, I'm looking at 49. 49 is super close to what number? 49, 50. It's super close to 50. So in my mind, I'm going to think 49 is kind of by 50 and 33 is kind of by what? Kind of by 30. Okay. So the answer should be close to 80. Not perfect, but close to around 80, okay? So that kind of gives us an estimate of where we should be. So I'm gonna put 80 up there. Should be close to that. All right, so here's 49. Let's do it with our tens and ones. 10, 20, 30, 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9, 49. And then 33, 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33. All right, so that's what we have. That's what we're working with. All right, so nine plus three, nine one plus three one. What is nine plus three? Nine, 10, 11, 12. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Can you see that 10? 11, 12. So we have two left over, but we can make a 10. So let's push this 10 over here. So nine plus three was 12. So two down at the bottom and one new 10 up here. It's almost like we took that 12 and cut it in half. Two stays at the bottom or stays up in the ones column. And then we made that one new 10. All right, so then we can add uh, four 10s plus three tens, how much is four and three? Four and three is seven, and then one more ten. Seven, eight. Good. The answer, the real answer is 82. Remember I said it was gonna be close to about 80? 80? 82 is pretty close. So we're probably correct, and we are correct, of course. So 49 plus 33 is 82. All right. Let's, uh, let's pretend that we're at home and you guys don't have your tens and ones. So let's try drawing it, okay? Let's pretend I don't have my tens and ones because I don't in my house. So I want to try drawing it. So 49. Now you can do sticks like this, 20, 30, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 33, 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33. That's the kind of the fast way we've been doing tens and ones. You could make them like the french fries because you know there's 10 little ones inside of there, right? Yeah, and you could make your dots kind of closer to squares like that. But you know these are tens and ones. All right, nine ones plus three ones, nine and three. Let's make that a dot so we don't get confused. Okay, so nine and one more. Whoop. Nine and ten, so we made a uh, ten, right? Nine and one more is ten. And then eleven, twelve. So twelve. Nine and three is twelve. So we made a new ten. So we can erase this and make it a ten if we want. Okay? And then you have two lectures. Nine plus three is twelve. Two down at the bottom, and you make your one new ten at the top. Four tens plus three tens, plus one ten, 
is what? Four and three is seven, and one more is eight. Eighty, eighty, two. Eighty, two is your answer. What do you think? Good. So you can draw it with your tens and ones just as easily. Oops, there's our light again. We're working hard, I guess. All right. The next question is going to be just like this. It's about a sloth. And do you know a sloth is so slow that he spends most of his life up in the branches, the tree branches. His body and his feet never even touch the forest floor. And while he's there, mold grows in his fur. That's how slow they are. That mold, you know the mold that grows on the side of the tree? Yeah, mold will grow inside their fur. And there'll be lots of little critters and stuff in there too, like um, fleas and bugs of all kinds of things. So let's pretend the sloth is eating. He's eating some, let's do plants because I know they like leaves. So let's see, sloth ate 28 leaves in the morning and he ate 14 leaves in the evening. That's a hungry little sloth sitting there all day hanging around, okay? So we're gonna do 28 plus 14. Let's do another estimate, because that kind of gives us an idea of what our answer should be. 28 is kind of close to what? It's kind of close to 30, right? And 14 is kind of close to 10. So 30 and, four, 30 and 10 more is 40. So our answer should be around 40-ish, okay? So if we get an answer like 400 or 500, you're gonna know you did something wrong. It should be around 40 something. All right, so 28, 20, uh, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, where are they? Seven, eight, all right, here's my eight, 28, and then 14, what's 14? 14 is a 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14. All right, you ready? Eight plus four ones, so eight ones, eight ones and four ones. Those are the tens. Eight and four, how much is eight and four? Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Eight and four is 12. So I made a 10. It's two textures and one new 10 that we made, okay? So we have I move it over there, my new 10. Good job. All right, and it's almost like we took that 12. We put the one over here and the two at the bottom, 12. All right, so eight and four is 12. The two down, the one new 10 at the top. So now we can add two 10s plus one 10 is three 10 plus one more. Three, four, four new 10. Remember I said the answer should be around 40. Is 42 around 40? Yeah, so we know we're kind of in the right area. And that is the correct answer. All right, erase the speedy quick. Now, the next one we, that we do, I'm gonna pretend I am you and I don't have any tens and ones at my house. So I'm gonna have to draw it for the next one, okay? Or do it in some other way. Uh, let's see, this one is about a toucan. You know, toucans have those long beaks. Their beaks are almost the same size as their body, right? And they're hard and sharp. And they're made that way because they eat fruits and seeds. Um, so let's pretend, a, a, not a sloth, a toucan ate 56 seeds, seeds, and 36 um, fruits. Keep them busy. Yeah, they eat a lot too, don't they? So we want to add 56 and 32. So 56 is almost to 60. So I'm going to put 60. And 32 is close to 30. So 60 and 30 is 90. So our answer should be around 90-ish. 80, like high 80s, 90. So let's put 90 up here. It should be around 90. So if you get 900, you know you did something wrong. Okay, so I'm pretending I don't have any tens and ones because I'm going to pretend I'm you at home with, that, with just your board or paper. So six plus two, oh, this is not the first, uh-oh, this job did it wrong. 
Uh oh, this was supposed to be 36 uh, seeds and fruits. Uh oh, so we have to do that again. 56 is close to 60, and 36 is actually closer to 40. So our answer should be around 100. Ooh, big numbers. All right, so it should be around 100, close to it. All right, now we're gonna pretend that we don't have any sensor blanks at home. All right, so 56, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. All right, there's my 56 and tens and ones, the fast way. And here's 36, 10, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. All right, so 6 plus 6 is how much? That's double. 6 plus 6 is 12. So I can make a 10, whoop, and cross these out and make a new 10. And have two extras. So um, 6 and 6 is 12. We have two extras and one new 10 that you made. See, you took that 12 and you broke it apart. Two down at the bottom, one at the top. But the one is for that one extra 10 you made. All right, now we have to add it up. Five plus three is eight. 10 plus one more is nine. 92. So let's do that again. One, two, three, four, five, 10. Plus the new 10 is six. Plus three more, seven, eight, nine. Nine tens. So nine tens and two ones is 92. 92, which is close to 100. Yeah, so we were close. So if we get something crazy, like 900, you know you did it wrong, but we didn't, we got 92. All right, how'd you do with that one? Good, all right. We are gonna continue to work on those regrouping, those really hard ones. And then later on, we might even know, learn what to do with subtraction with big numbers. Hmm, when it's greater than 10. Hmm. So, all right, I'm going to erase this. You keep working. And uh, in your packet, there are some review pages. I think there's graphing, um, addition, subtraction. There are some review pages of skills that we already know. Uh, so the way it's going to work is all week for our questions on YouTube, we're going to work on regrouping. But then in your packet, you have some things that you already know how to do that you can do it yourself that you are gonna um, do and return to me or take a picture and upload to me so that we can um, review as well. We don't wanna forget any of those other skills like graphing and addition and subtraction and number order and those kinds of things and money, okay? All right, so keep learning.